Good morning, guys. Today, we're just walking around a bit outside, checking out the trails, seeing what, uh, what the snow situation's like. And, I mean, it is receding a fair amount, but still got quite a bit of snow on the trail here. Oh, what's this? trail that goes up to the more popular hikes in the area, Big Beehive, Mirror Lake, Lake Agnes, etc, etc. I said small little beehive. <laughs> small little beehive. <laughs> yeah, the two trails, Big Beehive and Small Beehive. Basically it's a small mountain that looks like a beehive, so. Wait, Thus the odd name. Lake Agnes is where there's a tea house where everyone's coming. Yeah, that's where all the tourists go. Not this year, probably. Another breathtaking shot here on the trail. Isabel's taking some ah, photos. <laughs> the whole video YouTube thing we were actually dabbling in photography so we started the whole Instagram thing before this YouTube thing so if you guys like travel photos or outdoor photography that sort of thing hiking photos you can check out Isabel's Instagram no. or mine hers is better though um... Basically why we, why we came out here today is to check the level of snow on the trails. Just to get a general idea of, of how high or low it is. Um, last year it was definitely probably three times higher than it is now, if not even more. And even in June there was more snow than this. And it's only, we're only in like what, not even mid-May yet, so it's looking really promising. So kind of hoping the next couple of days we can uh, maybe do a hike like a proper hike and then we can uh, maybe make a video about that kind of something a little more rugged instead of these tiny walks that we do I don't know if you guys can see this in the camera but there's like little flies yeah you can see some I don't know what you call those like smaller than a mosquito. The sun has broken out, so stopped here to take a couple of photos of the sun rays coming through the forest. Looks looks quite beautiful. And as you can see, there's a considerable amount of snow. However, 
Uh, the trail is quite packed, so it's no trouble walking on it. Stopping for some more photos here on the Lake Louise Trail, which is not called the Lake Louise Trail. What is this trail called again? The trail to... I don't remember the name. I don't even know the trail has a name. It's just a generic... <clears throat> this is just a generic tourist trail. You'll see all sorts of people coming here. Regular people, locals, tourists, mountaineers. Oh, that's what you mean by all sorts. Okay. Yeah. Let's clarify on that. Thank you. Um, no joke. We even seen people with, like, you know, the baggage with a the carry rollers on, on it. Carry on. But the ones, you know, that has a little handle and the wheels on the bottom. And they're carrying that up here on this trail. This trail. See? <laughs> <laughs> so if you guys... Well, me personally, I use a backpack. This one here on my back. Um, I just find like the shoulder straps uh, and the fact that it's on, on my back, not rolling on the ground. Uh, it's a lot easier to maneuver and uh, kind of hike up this trail. <laughs> it is, that's true. It's very personal. Nothing against using a carry-on while you're hiking. Um, I met a girl that one time she had they had to go on a hike. Yep. And she used high heels. Oh, that's good. She showed up on the bus with high heels. Yeah. Well, I mean, me personally, I mean, I don't wear high heels myself. But I mean, if you guys want to wear high heels, I wouldn't really recommend it because <laughs> that's why you're gonna okay. break an ankle. <laughs> However, I mean, if you want to work out your calf muscles or something like that, and that's why you're wearing high heels, well, all the power to you. And then you can uh, wear high heels. <laughs> As well, of course, we have our bear spray here. in the background, we got the clouds coming in. Very nice, very nice. So it is getting chilly. So we did very nice. <laughs> so we did gain a bit of elevation there, so it's definitely getting a little chillier here, plus the wind's coming in. Um, the beginning of the video I was talking about a very touristic hike called Big Beehive. That's just up there. And you can kind of see it looks like a beehive, apparently. I mean, I guess everyone sees something different. <laughs> from, the from the Oh, sorry, from the bottom it looks no, like a beehive. Wait. From Mirror Lake, actually. You can from see Mirror Lake? It. All right. Yeah, so we're going to trek up to Mirror Lake, and I'll take another video um, of Big Beehive from there. And just let me know in the comments, what do you think it looks like? Does it look like a beehive, or does it look like something else? Oh. Who knows the settlers? Settlers? How you say that? Settlers. Settlers. The settlers. 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 I came here first. They name those things. Yeah. The Swiss. Yes. No, what was it here? Yeah, uh, I think it was Swiss. In, the, in this specific area, it's Swiss. Yeah, but Bath is Scottish people, I believe. Oh. But, if I'm incorrect, uh, just let me know how dumb I am in the comments down below. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're almost there, guys. Almost at Mirror Lake. Pretty excited to show you the color. <clears throat> the color of Mirror Lake. Oh, I hope so. Melted? <laughs> I'm hoping so. I yeah, I can't even guarantee you it's melted. I have no idea. But... Because it's kind of, the sun kind of does hit it, so maybe a part of it is melted. And I want to show that green color in the video. It's really cool. The moss is looking quite lively. Still on the trail. And 
as you can see, there's definitely a lot more snow here. The sun's breaking out again. There you have it, guys. Mirror Lake. And it's completely frozen. Well, that's a big beehive. What do you guys think? Does it look like a beehive? disappointed. <laughs> Why? You've been here so many times. I know, but I was picturing a thing like kind of half melted. I had no idea. You can see all the snow we have, right? I mean, we're not supposed to be this high right now. That, that thing should be a little bit higher than us. Right? Or no? No? Okay. I have no comment. Perhaps I dreamt just a little too much. <laughs> ah, it's all good. <clears throat> What's up? I'm gonna take a photo of this. I think, it, I think it'll be a good shot. Well guys, I think uh, I'm gonna end the video there. Uh, we're just on our way back down. Um, the clouds broke up even more, as you can see, a lot more blue sky. So I'm hoping tomorrow, um, maybe we can do something, but unfortunately I think tomorrow's going to be overcast, so I'm not really sure what that will bring. But anyway, I think we covered a few topics today. Um, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. Other than that, I think I'll be checking out. All right, ciao.